Among older females, the queen had a strong group of challengers. Life at 10. Life at 10 was a late bloomer at the age of five. Her five stakes wins included the grade two Delaware Handicap and grade one Ogden Phipps and Beldame. Life at 10 on top now by two lengths. It is Life at 10, a clear cut and decisive winner. Unrivaled Bell. Unrivaled Bell had an early win over defending horse of the year, Rachel Alexandra. She saved her best for last, however, winning the Breeders' Cup Ladies Classic. Unrivaled Bell coming out to score. Unrivaled Bell take the Ladies Classic. Zenyatta. Zenyatta flashed her magic in five grade one wins while running her unbeaten streak to 19 including an easy win in the Santa Margarita. Zenyatta is playing with them. Yet another unbelievable win. Older female. And the Eclipse Award goes to Zenyatta. Accepting the Eclipse Award for Zenyatta are her owners, Jerry and Ann Moss. Zenyatta becomes the second horse, along with Azari, to win Older Female Eclipse Award three times, having also taken the honor in 2008 and 2009. As a six-year-old, Zenyatta won four grade one races in 2010, the Apple Blossom Vanity, Clement Hirsch, and the Lady's Secret. She won 19 consecutive career races before finishing second by a head in last year's Breeders' Cup Classic. Trained by John Sheriffs and Ridden in all of her races this year by Mike Smith, Zenyatta was bred in Kentucky by Maverick Production Limited. Well, we've been on just, a, just an unbelievably remarkable ride for the last three years. Um, you've been so gracious to give us this award. This is the third year in a row, and uh, she just keeps on going. And uh, we can't thank everybody enough, especially our fans and her fans, I should say, because they're her fans. And, um, you know, to the, to the um, 45,000 people that showed up on a Friday at Oaklawn Park, to the, to the biggest uh, um, vanity crowd, I think, in 10 years at uh, Hollywood Park, to the, what she did for the television ratings and, and all the letters and postcards and photos and uh, trophies and little emblems and, peop you know, the, the poems and things we get every day. <laughs> you know, from people all over the country and all over the world. And uh, we got to thank these fans. Uh, Zenyatta has left the racetrack. Uh, I hope as an industry we can keep these fans. Uh, she touched these people in a very special way. And they're all amazing people and they're all, they all just loved her. And I think that if we work hard, I think if we give them a greater uh, position in our business, let them help us with maybe these very same awards. Who knows? I mean, the fans picked the baseball all-star team, so who knows what they're capable of in our sport, but we have to welcome them. We cannot turn them away. So I want to thank them again. I want to uh, thank John Sheriffs, Mike Smith, everybody for just the amazing job they have done in keeping this mayor in, in great spirits for almost four years. Uh, on top of that, we want to thank our families. Uh, can't tell you how many invitations we've had to turn down over the last four years. <laughs> Uh, every time we hear something and we say, oh, gee, it's a kid's birthday, but we got a race. You know, what are we going to do? <laughs> I'm sure you've all been in the same situation. So uh, we'd like to thank our families for their uh, great patience with us. We love them, and I know they love us, and we appreciate it. Everyone, thank you so much, and we're very grateful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.